Hi, Scott Israel here with First Vision. And today we're going to talk about powering cameras. Cameras need some sort of DC power to make them work. Most of them use 12 to 24 volts in. USB and Firewire cameras are powered by the respective USB and Firewire ports. Gigi cameras have to be powered as well. Some have PoE, that's power over Ethernet, and can be powered over the Ethernet cable. Otherwise, they must also need power. Most of the cameras we sell have a connector on the back end for both power and the I.O. lines. Here you can see what one of these connectors looks like. This is a Hyros connector. First Vision makes a power supply that plugs into the wall and has a connector on the back end, and then you would just plug these two in like that. However, what happens if you want to use the I.O. lines? With this connector, you can't get to them. First Vision also makes a cable that has flying leads. Here you see one end plugs into the back of the camera here and then the rest of the leads are color coded. We also supply a color code diagram that allows you to know which pin goes to which color. First Vision also makes a power supply that has flying leads and to use these two you would just couple the proper leads together. You can either use this with solder and a heat shrink tube, or here I have a very inexpensive $1 Molex connector where you can put in the wires from one side here, the wires from the other side on the other end, and screw these together. Hopefully this is a quick explanation of how you can power your cameras and also get your I.O. Be sure to visit our website, www.firstvision.com, that's the number one stvision.com and look under the heading accessories.